What are you thankful for on Thanksgiving? I think that is. What are you thankful for on Thanksgiving today? Oh, I'm thankful that the Lord has let me live the age I am. I'm thankful for so-called good times right now, even though the stock market is not doing so well. I'm thankful that there's a lot of people being fed that would not have been fed if we didn't have kind people in the world. And all kinds of good things in the world to smile and be glad about. Yeah. Rather than be sad about. Yeah. And I don't really particularly care about Obama, but I'm glad that we've got another president and maybe things will be better now than they have been in the yeah. past. Yeah. There's several things I'd think about, but I'm thankful the good Lord left me live and he died on the cross for me. Yes. And everybody's been real nice to me. Yes. And looked out for me and saw me in a new apartment and watching over the house. And let's see, there's a lot of things I can think about. I'm thankful to have had uh, Bud and Betty across the way from me. God bless them. Delivered all the papers and doing all the kind deeds for me they have done. I'm thankful that Bob and Bonnie are across the way that love me and she comes to me when she has any down problems and uh, we hug each other and tell each other we're sorry that those things <coughs> happened and uh, all sorts of goodies. Yeah. And I'm thankful that I live on in Anderson, Indiana, that we've got a good governor in the state who is really a Republican governor and who runs the mm -hmm. place and runs it properly, too, even if we have got a Democrat in the Washington. Yep. <laughs> At least we've got a Republican in the state. Yeah. And he is a good person. Nobody ever said one word against him, not yep. one. I, I like to think that I'm a good politician. Yeah. And I like to think the Lord thinks that I'm a fairly decent person. Yeah. And... Uh, there's so many things that I'm thankful I had all the people that I had to back me up as grandparents and parents and who held me up by the hangers of the wall and straightened my spine while they put the plaster cast from here to here three months on me. Yeah, and you couldn't walk up steps. What? You couldn't walk up steps. No, I couldn't. And I'd have a stitch that felt like it was that big on my body when I'd have to stretch yeah. from that, from those plaster casts. That got over, I got over that, and so he kept me from having to walk like this, bent over a, a, a loaded basket, you know, like a grocery cart. Yeah. The one woman I saw the other day who was so bent over, she her head was level with the door of yeah. the cart she was pushing, Ugh. and I felt so sorry looking at her and how lucky I was that somebody cared enough for me. I went through the Kentucky Crippled Children's Commission for that. Yeah. And um, having met your Grandpa Lee, and he had done all kinds of work in his life, and from 13 years, well, before 13 years old, he carried newspapers to earn a little money mm -hmm. because his dad died when he was seven years old. Yeah. And so he was thankful to do all the things that he did and never said one word against any of the people he worked for. Not one word. He never complained about anything he did or mm -hmm. had ever done. I mean, he'd never complain her. Yeah. And he made the life I'm living today. Mm -hmm. And he was a wonderful hubby and a good man and I loved him dearly. <laughs> I just loved him. So, I've had a real, real lucky life. Yep. Some of my cousins may not know this stuff. Well, I, I'm sorry for them. I know, me too. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just happy to, I'm happy to have lived 89 years and I'm ready to go whenever the Lord takes me and I'm ready to abide by what He expects me to do. I go to church whenever possible, and I'm not teaching Sunday school anymore as of this past Sunday because I can't, I can't see that well. And let's see, I guess I'm just, quote, a free bird from here on in. <laughs> to 
quote Leonard Skinner. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm thankful for. Yeah. And I'm sitting here like a lump on a log. <laughs> well, we're thankful to have you here. Yes. <laughs> I just love everybody and I hope everybody likes me. We do. I try. <laughs> Whenever I do any other way, I say whatever or whoever. <laughs> That's my favorite words. Well, yeah, I know. I hear you yes. say whatever all the time. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> Just like Grandpa used to say, so what? Who cares? <laughs> right, right. Those are his favorite words. Yep. Mine are mine. <laughs> I see everybody out on the door as far as they go, as far as I'm able, and they come back sometimes, sometimes they don't, but when they do, I can hug them or kiss them or whatever. <laughs> whatever. <laughs> whatever, yes, whatever. <clears throat> yeah. I can face the world with a clean, empty, empty feeling of consciousness of being uh, sort of wishing bad luck on people.